So for our API, we will be developing this using Node.js. If you're not familiar, Node.js is an open source cross-platform JavaScript runtime environment that executes JavaScript code outside of a browser. And so to follow along with the videos, you will need to have Node.js installed on your machine. So in your browser, if you go to nodejs.org, you'll be taken to this page here, and you'll be able to download a version for your particular operating system. So there'll be two different versions. One will be LTS, and the other one will be current. Uh, so I recommend the LTS version. Uh, so this is the long-term support. So this is the currently the supported version of Node.js. You are welcome to use the current release uh, that has the latest features. But I do recommend the LTS version since that's what we'll be using for this course. Um, so to download it, go ahead and click on the LTS button. You'll be going prompted to download the package. We'll go ahead and save. So then after the package has been installed, you want to go ahead and run your installer for your appropriate operating system. So this may be different because I am on a Mac. So after you run the installer, uh, you'll be prompted and it'll let you know you'll be installing Node and NPM. Uh, so to install Node, you'll need to agree to the software license agreement. So if you want to go ahead and pause the video and read that. And then next, you just need to go ahead and continue through the prompts until you install Node on your machine. Uh, this may take a few minutes. All right, so to verify if Node is uh, installed and working correctly, let's go ahead and open up a new terminal or command prompt. And then once you're there, if you go ahead and do Node-V, It'll show you which version of Node that you currently have installed on your machine and which one's been resolved. And then also, if you do npm-v, it'll show you which version of npm is currently installed as well.